hello everyone in this video i'm going to show you how to create this blurry sunset illustration in ibs paint text first i'm opening a new layer and in the new layer i'm using filter draw filter in that i'm using parallel gradation filter to create this gradient background for the sunset illustration and same then i am creating the new layer to, uh, to draw the uh, sunset so i am using add brush trapezoid 60 percentage brush and using bright yellow color to create the sun uh, and as it goes and i am changing the color from dark you know bright yellow to, to almost like a bg color to create this blurry gradient sun is setting down so in the new layer i am drawing this uh, circle using fill tip and hard brush and using a fill uh, tool to fill it then over it i am using add brush trapezoid 60 percentage just to make it little bit blurry so in the new layer and which is below the sunset layer i am going to draw these stars so for stars i'm using this brush but the i have to change settings of this to make it look like more scattered usually this brush uh, default setting uh, gives you like line of uh, stars which don't look good so i just change the settings you can just stop and check what are this uh, setting changes i have made to make it look more scattered so I just changed opacity, increased, decreased to make it look like some stars are brighter and some stars are, you know, dull somewhere uh, far away. So like that. And then I'm going to create a new layer and in this layer I'm going to use the felt tip pen hard brush to draw the crane bird. So I'm just drawing the bird. I, this is going to be not like a real bird. I am going to draw this as a cellulite. So, just uh, drawing the shape of the bird and filling it with the black color using the bucket tool. So, I am drawing its legs, long legs. Okay, once I am done, I am just going to duplicate this layer, the bird layer, and going to use horizontal flipping desirable here at the right corner and going to reduce the size using transform tool and make it look like a smaller bird or like the bird is far away from the first one so once i'm done i'm going to merge this two in a single layer and using the blur filter gaussian blur to make it look like blur because this bird is also going to be in a distance from the view so once I'm done, I'm creating a new layer and using maroon color and the brush I used is felt tip pen hard to draw this grass. This layer is also going to be a uh, blurred one. So I'm just using pencil hashtag one brush to draw the leaves of the uh, what you can say like grass leaves so i'm drawing bigger smaller grasses and once i'm done i'm using the same gaussian blur for this layer to make it blurry which is also far away from the view and once i'm done i'm just going to create new layer and repeat the same process but with the black color and in this time we're going to be a little bit larger and this is going to be very clear cut from our view so i'm not going to do any um, uh, i'm not going to apply any blur uh, filter over here just drawing so I, we have to draw very clearly because and very beautifully and don't make it look like more uh, symmetry because never uh, the grass is never going to be uh, symmetry like that so make it look a little bit clumsy like that. so once i'm done and the new layer i'm using add brush trapezoid 60 percentage brush to create that blurry faded look using maroon color and then with the black color and making this layer blending mode as multiply 
so again uh, in this the top i feel like i need some more darkness so i am using dark purple color and just picking the darkest purple from the using the eyedropper and make uh, choosing some more darkness color dark color and using the air brush to create some darkness over there at the top and this is the final look i hope you like this tutorial and thank you subscribe to my channel